My name is Dylan. I am a fifth year at Rathove College and I am here to talk about the technology that I use both inside and outside of school uh, and what I use it for. So first and foremost is the iPad I'm recording this video on. Uh, the iPad is a great tool. Um, I've used it for about six years now almost. Um, I use it for taking photos, for reading ebooks, and for browsing the internet for essay purposes and for research purposes. Let me go through them one by one. So the ebooks are online books that are pretty much identical to uh, normal paper books that you would get in school, but the only difference is that it's on your iPad um, and it has two really neat functions. The first one is that it can read to you. Now, if you suffer from eye fatigue, which I do, then this will be very beneficial to you. Eye fatigue is basically where your eyes get stingy and sore after staring at a screen for too long, whether it be because the screen's too bright or because your eyes just don't do well with screens. Um, so what the ebook can do is it can actually read out the page or, and, and the words to you. Um, the second thing that it's able to do is you're able to zoom in and out. So you're able to zoom in and out of uh, the different words, the different pages, uh, depending on what's comfortable for you to read. So then obviously I use it for browsing the internet as well, like I said, for research. Uh, the iPad is a very fast device, um, so getting in and out of the internet and switching back and forth is really easy. And then taking photos, if there's something on the board that I need to take a photo of uh, because they're moving too quickly and I need to take down the notes, uh, I can do that too. Another thing that my iPad has is an app called Schoology. Schoology allows the teachers to put up PowerPoints and presentations that I can use then to take down notes and to learn from and use them to study. The second thing I use is the Connect 12. Now the Connect 12 is very good in the sense that it allows me to both zoom in and out of say the board uh, and it also has a great file management system. It's where I write up all my essays and my documents um, and it also allows me to take pictures as well but pictures of uh, say pages and then it's able to read the words off the physical pages and then put it into actual text and read it off to you. It's insane how it does it. Um, I've been using the Connect 12 for about almost a year now and it is just an amazing piece of equipment. Uh, the Connect 12 as I said is used for vision so it has a camera on it and you can zoom in and out. Um, but much more than the uh, iPad's camera, which is why I prefer using the Connect 12's camera. Um, another thing that the Connect 12 is good for is file management. As I said before, it's much easier to track where your files are coming and going from. Uh, one thing it lacks though is speed. It's not as fast as an iPad, so I wouldn't use it to uh, go on the internet and I wouldn't use it to take pictures of the board because the camera is actually on the bottom of the, uh, the Connect 12 itself. And the Connect 12 is basically just a beefy Android tablet. Um, I used to use a computer and a Liberty Scholar. A uh, computer just didn't work for me. It was too big, too bulky, and was too awkward to use, and too took too long to put away. And the Liberty Scholar was a, I guess you could say, a less advanced version of the Connect 12. It had the camera, it just didn't have the everything else. Like they had no uh, Android tablet or any internet connectivity. Um, one of the notions is that all sizes, or one size fits all, all sizes fits all. No, that's the opposite. One size fits all. So if you're using an iPad, you're expected to use your iPad for the entirety of the school year. You're not. Use what you think works. If an iPad works and you have a computer, ask for an iPad. Because it's a detriment to you if you use something you're not comfortable with or if there's something better out there that you can use. An iPad works for me but it might not work for you. The Connect 12 works for me, but it might not work for you. Do you ever come from? Uh, lastly, to wrap this up, uh, I have things I use at home, such as my phone, a Huawei P20 Lite. It's a very good phone, served me well, very durable. Uh, I also use it sometimes to go on Schoology. Um, I have my computer, which I uh, play my games on, be uh, relaxing, you know, leisure. And I also have my Switch and my Nintendo DS, which are also for leisure. So they are not used for academic purposes whatsoever. So I hope this video helped. I uh, hope it helped you gain a better understanding of technology uh, and the technology that I use and the technology that perhaps you could use. Uh, thank you for listening.